Cell culture is the process by which human-derived cells are grown in the lab under controlled conditions outside of their natural environment. At ADRI, a range of asbestos-related cancer cell lines are routinely cultured. These cell lines serve as a useful tool for downstream laboratory applications aimed to elucidate the cellular mechanisms that mediate asbestos-related disease. Personal protective gear, such as a lab gown and gloves, are worn at all times when handling the cells within the biosafety cabinet. This prevents both contamination to the cells as well as to the researcher handling them. The cells are cultured under sterile conditions within a laminar flow biosafety cabinet. A 70% ethanol solution is sprayed onto gloves and equipment prior to placing them into the biosafety cabinet to prevent contamination. The cells are grown in specialised growth media containing the necessary supplements that mimic the internal conditions of the human body. The growth media needs to be replenished on a regular basis as the cells utilise and deplete nutrients within the media. The growth media, which has been preheated to 37 degrees, is removed from the water bath and placed into the biosafety cabinet. The growth media is aspirated from the cell culture flask and replaced with the fresh media. The cell culture flask is then placed back into a cell incubator and maintained at 37 degrees in humidified conditions. Once the cells become highly confluent, meaning they have grown to a point whereby they cover the entire surface of the culture vessel, the cells can be harvested by enzymatic manipulation. This is carried out by aspirating the growth media from the culture flask and adding a trypsin solution. The trypsin enzymatically induces the release of the cells from the base of the culture flask, which can then be visualised with a microscope. The harvested cells can then either be collected and cryogenically stored in a cell biobank for future use, diluted in fresh growth media and transferred to a new culture vessel for continued growth, or they can be transferred to a culture plate for downstream drug treatments.